Five unusual people in the world, part two hundred and twelve. Hello, everyone. I'm Kisha, and hope you have a new day full of happiness. I'm not a reporter, but I will bring lots of stories about the most amazing people to you. You might have never heard or known about these people, or not even think that they do exist in this world. Who are they? Let's meet them through this video. Are you ready? Let's begin. The pain made it impossible for him to sleep at night, so he repeatedly asked the doctors to amputate these hands. Number five, Abu Bajender. Bajender suffers from a strange disease that causes warts on his hands to form tricks and sometimes look like the tentacles of a kraken octopus. The former rickshaw puller is known by many as Tree Man. He has made headlines around the world, has not worked in years because the growth have left him unable to use his hands. He suffers from a very rare genetic condition known as epidermal dysplasia of erosiformis, which causes strangely shaped warts all over his body. Appeared at the age of ten, some people try to stay away from him when he's on the street. They don't like sitting next to him. But Chandra's life and daily activities became much more difficult. He had to quit his job, unable to eat, dress, and clean on his own, and he can't even hold his old child. He tried finding different medicine doses to improve the situation by himself, but there were no good results. He underwent a total of 24 extremely painful surgeries to improve his condition. The Bangladesh government decided to finance the hospital fees, so Bajender had the first surgery to remove the bark layer on his arms and legs in early 2016. In 2017, they have reappeared in larger numbers. His family stopped the treatment and sent him back to their village. Number 4. Annie Jones Elliot Annie Jones Elliot was born on July 14, 1865, and died on October 22, 1902. She was born in Virginia, USA, and a world-famous woman at that time, with a bushy beard like a man. Even many men aspired to have such a beard. Not only did she have a long beard, but her hair was also over 19.68 feet long. She was known as Baby Esau, and later, the Lady of Esau. Born with a chin covered in fine hair, Annie's parents and close relatives were horrified by her appearance. However, it wasn't long before they realized the monetary benefit of this extraordinary daughter. Doctors think it may be due to the high levels of male hormones. However, that has not been confirmed. They let her start her career in the circus. Her unique appearance attracted the attention of a light performer, P.T. Barnum. Her stage name was also changed a lot to match her age. Throughout her career, she toured many places, working with many museums. She was also known for her musical skills and graceful etiquette. During her 36-year career, Annie became the most famous bearded lady in the country. In 1902, she got ill while visiting her mother in Brooklyn and died at the age of 37. Number 3. Chandra Oram Chandra Oram is an Indian tea worker living in Chalpaiguri, West Bengal. He is famous for his 13-inch long tail, which makes him devoted by those who believe that he is the reincarnation of Hanuman, a monkey god in the Hindu religion. Human embryos can develop a real tail, because the genes that cause it are still present in many people. Doctors have denied what those people see as miracles. They think it's a congenital deformity known as Bina Bifida. The tail that Aurum has is not a real tail, but a birth defect. Many people come to seek blessings and even cures. They want to touch his tail because they believe it brings good luck. Aurum refused any surgery to remove his tail, as it brings him good luck. In addition to his strength tail, Aurum is also very good at climbing trees, which makes his devotees believe more. However, this also makes girls not dare to be his wife. In 2007, he married a woman who accepted that tale, and they have had one child. Everyone has a different taste in food, and there are always those with strange eating habits. 
Number two, Michel Latito. Michel Latito was born on June 15, 1950, and died on June 25, 2007. He is also known as Monsieur Montitude because of his ability to eat anything from the age of nine. Please remember, he is an Earthling, a French man, not an alien. This French man currently holds the record for the weirdest diet in the Guinness Book of World Records. He suffered from an eating disorder known as pica, a psychological disorder characterized by cravings for substances that are largely non-nutrients. Latito also had unusually strong digestive juices, which means he can digest metal. Doctors determined that Latito had a thick lining in his stomach and intestines that allowed him to consume sharp metal without injury. He had no ill effects from ingesting materials, even those considered to contain harmful chemicals. Michel Latito started eating unusual things around the age of 16, and he performed publicly since 1966. From 1959 to 1997, Latito ate about 9 tons of metal with just a little oil, water, and normal digestion. This gentleman's most luxurious meal was to eat a chestnut 150 plain, which took him two years to eat. Fans of the Star Wars series will certainly not forget Peter Mayhew's role as Wookiee Chewbacca. Number 1. Peter Mayhew Peter Mayhew was born on May 19, 1944, in Surrey, England. He played the character Chewbacca in all of his live action appearances from the 1977 original to 2015's The Force Awakens before retiring from the role. He is an English American actor famous for his huge height of 7 feet 3. According to the doctors, he has gigantism, which is a condition that affects the development of children. This condition occurs due to an excessive increase in hormone levels during childhood. This change is largely reflected in the height and body size of the child. Mayhew gained his first acting job when the producers of Sinbad and the Eye of the Tiger, 1977, discovered him from a photograph in a newspaper article about men with large feet and cast him in the role of the Minotin. Although his character is a fierce-looking hairy character, he always has a sweetheart, with the charity Peter Mayhew. In 2013, he was forced to have two knee replacement surgeries due to his terrible height. He died of a heart attack on April 30, 2019, at his home in Boyd, Texas, three weeks before his 75th birthday. Difference creates many special individuals. None of us resemble anyone. That creates a colorful and surprising society that no one ever expects. Thank you for watching the video. Don't forget to subscribe, turn on your notification bell to receive more interesting videos. Now, goodbye and see ya!